going to start you folks off with a question. If you love to do something no one else wanted to do, how would it change your life? Imagine if you could be the give me the ball person in your company or on your team. And whenever an opportunity comes up to speak at a conference like this or be in a video or give a sales pitch or run a meeting or anything that involves you standing and talking, you could be the give me the ball person. Beer to Fun was a revelation for me as a speaker. I was so excited to discover there's a real biological reason why more people fear public speaking than almost anything else. America, the number one fear, the fear that beats all of these. Public speaking. <laughs> that means, as Jerry Seinfeld once said, that if you're at a funeral, you would rather be in the casket than delivering the eulogy. I wanted to share that knowledge with all those folks who are letting speaking anxiety hold back their careers and their lives and show them how to conquer it. It's very common for folks when they think about speaking situations to imagine the worst possible scenario and they imagine it so often that it starts to become a certainty. And because of that, the brain engages the very same fight or flight response to protect you and try to save your life. Your fear of speaking is the fight or flight response. The best part for me is when someone tells me later, because of your advice, I made the sale or aced my job interview or gave a great wedding toast. That's why I do it. So you imagine yourself in that moment giving that presentation, right? But instead of imagining everything going wrong, you imagine everything going right. This program really resonates with audiences. They get so into it, and I love seeing all those smiles and nodding heads from the stage. The really great can make you feel that you too can become great. Yeah. <laughs> Now exhale gently through your mouth and imagine that ball spilling all over your shoulders and back and relaxing you. Thank you. Thank you.